Hey, Alex, when you look at the, the running back room and, and how these guys have progressed over the course of fall camp and then coming out of the spring when you didn't have Tyon Evans, what does that look like to you, especially the guys behind Jabari and Tyon? And, and a few guys like Jalen, maybe T, D, Beckwith, Pierce, how do you think that they've handled figuring out the scheme this fall? Done a really good job figuring out the scheme. Um, I think Jerry Mack, Matt Merritt, those guys have done an incredible job teaching those guys. I, that's one position that I'm uber excited about going into, into game day. I think Jabari's had the camp. We all hoped he would. Tyon, honestly, in a lot of ways, has sur surpassed my expectations. He's started to figure out what it is to be a Division I college football player. He was here in the spring. I think I've recruited junior college my whole career. You come in from a junior college, and it just hits you in the face. Um, and it took him a while to figure it out. Um, it really did. From how do I take care of my body? How do I sleep? When do I go to tutoring? Uh, all of that. Just how do I figure that out? It took him a minute. It was resistant a little bit at times to figuring it out. There was some nudging there. Uh, but I think Tyon has put it all together. Having only football for three weeks for Tyon was really, really good. Um, and so I'm excited to see what he, what he can do. Uh, he's a different back than than those other guys in the room. He's a bigger back. Um, been really pleasantly surprised with him. Jalen Wright, man, oh man, really, really excited about Jalen. Um, he, is, he is everything we had hoped he would be. Still a freshman, same sentiment as Miles Campbell. Now we just threw class on him. We threw, we, we threw the distractions around campus at him. Uh, he's gotta learn and grow, uh, but I think he's got a really, really bright future. Um, the other guys in that room with Marcus and, and D and, and, and those guys, we're, we're still, honestly, it, this, is, this is a true answer, still figuring out how the rest of the back end of that rotation shapes out. Um, I think it'll truly be by committee on the back end of it. And I think it'll be on the, by committee on the front end of it. You know, we, we really need four guys ready to rock and roll September 2nd. Um, obviously, those guys get nicked up as the season goes. COVID's a real deal right now. Like, we got to have five to six of those guys ready. So I'm excited about I'm excited about the three. I think Marcus has been steady Eddie for us, um, and and we'll continue to kind of figure it out. I think it'll be by committee on the back end of that rotation. But but really excited about that group. I think it'll be fun. Um, I think those guys all bring a different element. It's fun. It's fun to to be able to run different types of plays with those guys, um, and they have the ability to catch the ball out of the backfield, which is an element that that has been really, really fun to keep messing with.